We'll bring in Dr. Ken Kramer, research scientist with Space Up Close. Uh, thanks for joining us. I feel like we should be queuing the X-Files theme music, or at the very least, Purple People Leader. Why are conspiracy theorists so drawn to Area 50? I mean, is there an actual explanation for what alien and UFO enthusiasts think really goes on out there? Well, allegedly 60 years ago, you know, something happened there. In reality, absolutely nothing happened. So it just goes back to the story from the 1940s where they, they thought they found some aliens. But of course, they found nothing. And right now, it's just a bunch of people out to make money. That's all this is about, really. Well, money is important, Dr. Kramer. Are you surprised, though, that reportedly not a lot happened there today, uh, despite the buildup ahead of this event? Eventually, not so many people showed up. Look at the climate change protests today. So many people taking to the streets. Tell me, aren't UFOs and aliens more fascinating than the climate of this planet? Um, well, they may be more fascinating, but <laughs> what's more important was is the climate change. That's real, and I'm really glad you guys had a great story about climate change. That's something we really have to face, you know? There are no aliens. There's not a shred of evidence for it. And, and But what we are doing, I can tell you, what we are doing at NASA is we're looking for life beyond Earth. That's the real important thing, not looking for non-existent aliens here on Area 51. Yeah, that really exciting news, actually, within the past week about that uh, huge exoplanet discovered. It was uh, pretty exciting. Uh, the Navy this That's week, right. though, the Navy this week, though, admitted that two videos from 2017 showing UFOs are actually real. Navy pilots encountering mysterious spherical objects, only the Navy is not calling them UFOs. We have now come up with a different acronym. These are now UAPs for Unidentified Aerial Phenomena. Why call them something different, doctor? Well, the key is unidentified, and that means unidentified. If they were aliens, they would be identified as aliens, right? <laughs> it's just unidentified. So it, it's still the same thing. It's just a bunch of nonsense, all right? So there's no aliens. We've never been visited. It's good to look. And, you know, finding that planet that Hubble found that has water vapor gives us hope that there actually is life beyond beyond the Earth, and that's what we should be focusing on. Is there a logical explanation for what these videos show? You saw them, right? Yes, I did see them. I did see them. I, I don't know what the explanation is. I didn't find them all that, all that fascinating, actually. I don't know what it is. And so that's the whole point. You don't know what it is. And so because you don't know what it is, that doesn't mean you call it an alien. It means you don't know what it is, all right? Oh, that's interesting because there's plenty in this world that I don't know right. what in the world there's plenty it is. We don't know. But, you know, I'm giving a lecture about the search for life uh, tomorrow in Titusville. So you're all invited to come to that. Let me know if you find any. Uh, listen, the, the whole storm area 51 movement uh, that we've been reporting about here, uh, they, they, we were talking about it not being as bad as the local sheriff thought it would be. Right. A hundred people showed up at the entrance gate this morning. One was actually arrested for indecent exposure. Go figure. Uh, right. uh, listen, how dangerous is the whole fascination and, and um, the circus that's really kind of formed around area 51? Well, the circus is crazy and it's potentially dangerous. And if those people had stormed the gates, you know, they could have got seriously injured. All right. To say nothing of, 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 of the base itself, but they could have been but injured by, you know, who knows what 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 kind of counteractions from from the military. So thank God most of the people didn't come. Most of them, I'm sure, who did were there were were, were good natured about it. But um, you don't want to have a surprise giant group show up at a military base you know, here at the Kennedy Space Center, we have a lot of security around all the military bases with all the rockets and the military hardware. So you have to be really careful in this day and age of, of mass groups of unknown people. So I'm really glad that only a few people showed up and they were good natured about it for the most part. Well, the military is careful, and uh, that's what's very surprising here, I find, about, you know, the, the video that um, they confirmed. Uh, they're saying this is real. We believe the people who, who saw it. Uh, don't you think it's really significant? Well, it's significant that they saw something. But again, they don't know what they saw. Yeah, you're showing it right now. Yeah, it's really moving very quickly, but mm. we don't know what it is. Um, if, it, if it was aliens, <laughs> that would be, you know, super fantastic. But you know what? 
we don't have a shred of evidence since Area 51 was uh, first brought to brought to light. Where have the aliens been for the past 50 years? Why haven't we been visited since then? Okay, unless it's like Star Trek. And there's, you know, a great question. Uh, yeah. um, the, the, the non-interference directive, okay? But we haven't been visited, and there's no evidence, no hard evidence <laughs> oh. that we've been visited, okay? All right. Well, Dr. Ken Kramer, thank you. Uh, live long and prosper, sir. And prosper. I'm a big yeah. Star Trek fan. Yeah. Come to my lecture tomorrow all, all about right. exploring life in our solar system. All right, good to see you. Thanks a lot. Uh, Eric, oh, Eric, listen, I don't know. The doctor here was that, he was skeptic. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I think there's something out there. Yeah, I, I think, well, yeah, there's definitely something out there. I just have no idea what it is.